Well, I certainly think it's points worth making. As yeah. Assemblymember Duval has said in the letter, it says that the core element of those reports are true, namely that there was con contact. Now, this is the latest in a long line of slip-ups from your Deputy Mayor. His first appearance in front of the Police and Crime Committee has become a national joke. He's alienated many of us around this table. He's alienated many in the police. He hasn't mastered his brief um, uh, to actually do the things that you brought him in to do. I'm just asking if you still have full confidence in him. Of course I do, uh, Jenny. Um, of course I do. And um, thank you for giving me the opportunity to say something about uh, the Deputy Mayor of Police and Crime, who in my view is doing a first-rate job. Uh, we've been well, in a, um, a difficult uh, position nationally in the sense that the, the budget uh, for policing is being cut across the, the country. Uh, we're going to have a conversation later on about the economies we're being, we're being forced to make in um, and actually would probably make anyway. Uh, in uh, in the Met, uh, he, uh, he, he in my topic, view, has, uh, has built on the great work done by Kit Malthouse, is gripping no, uh, no, the, the, no, the situation I, uh, extremely well, and, and is, is producing uh, results which are allowing us not just to uh, make important savings, not just to make important savings, but to get more officers out on the beat and to keep crime coming down. How many and, more slip uh, I, can I he think afford? he's doing a first how rate many, job. How many and I think it's very, very sad. That I think it's, it's sad and, and, and reprehensible uh, that uh, you choose to drag in lots of extraneous matters uh, in uh, uh, an important discussion that, uh, about this, uh, this, this conduct thing uh, as part of a sort of general attack on him. He's doing a first rate job.